We come home exhausted, angry, frustrated, whatever. We want to go home, shut the door, and hide. We want to build our little cocoons. I get it. I understand. Don't misunderstand me. I'm with you guys. We find the place that we can hide out because the world around us is terrifying sometimes. It's frustrating. It's exhausting. It feels like that all the people want is something from us. They always ask. If the enemy can stop the church from being generous, and I say the church, I don't mean just the corporate building of a church, but the person who calls himself a follower of Christ. If the enemy can keep us from being generous, if the enemy can keep us from being rich in good deeds, the enemy wins. We live in a world where People wonder if the church is even relative. Like, why does it exist? What does it do? Why does it matter? If the church stopped existing, would anybody in your town know? That kind of stuff, right? We live in a world where it's kind of cool and faddish to say, I don't believe in God. I don't need church. And that's because the church has chosen to reflect its culture more than be counterculture in the midst of the culture. Our culture is not what it used to be. You think God knows that? You think God's surprised by that? You think God's overwhelmed by that? You think God's always got a plan? 